All right, guys, we're back. Uh, I'm out here at the track. I'm getting ready to do my little calisthenics workout, but uh, I wanted to come on here and give my final thoughts on the fight tonight. Javante Tank Davis defending his WBA lightweight title against a very, very game competitor in uh, Frank the Ghost Martin, guys, uh, the protege of Errol True Smith Jr. Uh, I did do a prediction video. Uh, you guys are welcome to check that out here on the channel. Uh, that was a, It was actually the last video I did here on the channel, so make sure you check that out if you get a chance. But uh, I want to talk about the weigh-in because I did that before the weigh-in. And uh, if you didn't know, Frank Martin came in at one, he came in at one uh, 34.4 pounds on the scale. I think Javante came in at 133.4 pounds on the scale. So both of the guys actually made weight. But the talk is, is how drained how drained Frank looked at the weigh-in, guys. Uh, you know, it was obvious. You know, his face looked sunken in. He had dark circles around his eyes. They were sunken in. Uh, he looked lethargic. You know, you could tell that he was extremely weight-drained uh, at the weigh-in. And, and that does concern me, especially with a guy like Javante Tank Davis, who's more experienced. You know, he's been on this big stage. Uh, he has that one-hitter-quitter power. And uh, he's a pretty damn good boxer. And the reason that concerns me is because not only can that affect you physically in a fight, it can affect you mentally as well. You know, you're not doing your best thinking when you're, you're dehydrated. You know, you, you can make the wrong decisions. And you don't want to make a mistake in a fight with a guy like that. You, you want to be, you want everything running on all cylinders. You know, mental game, physical game because you're in there with a guy uh, who can knock you out with one punch. So that does concern me about Frank the Ghost Martin in this fight. Hopefully, hopefully he rehydrates uh, back up, you know, good enough to put on a A-class performance, in my opinion. I, that's what I want. I want a fight that's competitive. I don't want to see a one-sided fight. Y you can already tell that Javante Tank Davis uh, mentally has the edge. He mentally has an edge in the fight. You can see it at the weigh-in. Uh, he was ex he was hydrated well. Uh, you know, he was even doing backflips at, at the weigh-in, and he seemed like you know he seemed like the guy that was more confident. I don't know if it's because Frank Martin was tired, or you know Frank Martin doesn't do a lot of trash talking. You guys know that, but uh, Javante just seems ex extremely confident in getting the win, and I think that has a lot to do with experience. Uh, being on this big stage, knowing that he has that power, and then with Frank Martin being weight drained, uh, yeah, that's going to give him even more confidence. And the reason I think Frank Martin was weight drained is because of him carrying, you know, a lot of muscle mass. If you didn't know, you know, look at Frank Martin. You know, he's chiseled from head to toe. Uh, he doesn't really have an ounce of fat on him, so it's hard to lose those pounds. And uh, I, I think, you know, that that was the issue. Uh, with the weight. That's why he looks so so drained in the face. So like I said, hopefully he rehydrates up properly uh, because I, I want him to be on his A game. You know, I, I like a competitive fight. You know, I, I, I picked Javante Tank Davis to win, but I said, you know, it wouldn't be an easy win. It would The fight would go late. So I'm giving away the video I, I did earlier, but still, you, you guys still need to check it out anyway. But uh, we'll see what happens. Uh, big fight tonight. Of course, David Benavidez making his debut at 175 against Alexander Vosick. That's going to be a hell of a fight. I think David pulls that one out. Uh, who else is on the card? Uh, Gary Antoine Russell uh, against uh, Alberto Puelo. Uh, I, I think Adamas uh, fights uh, Terrell Goucher. I think he's on the card as well. So it's a it's a pretty stacked card, guys. Uh, well, let me know what you think about Frank Martin uh, being weight drained. Uh, does that concern you? Uh, do you think uh, he'll be able to pull it out? You know, it, let me know what you guys think about it in the comments section. It's the CMB. I'll talk to you guys in the next one. And I'm out. Peace.